Good morning, adventurers. We're hanging out in New York City today. Yeah, we finally made it. It stopped raining and it's sunny. Yeah. Woo! It's sunny, but it's pretty cold out here. It is it's really like cold. in the mid 30s. Yeah. So Those it might look a lot warm. warmer than it is. Uh, so I think what we're going to do is go check out the view from the top of the Empire State Building because it's touristy, I know, but we've been to, to New York a handful of times and we've never got a chance to go up there because we're always like, eh, it's too touristy, too expensive. It costs like 32 bucks a person to go up there. So. It's crazy. But, you know, I really want to see the view, so Yeah, figure. you gotta do it once. Yeah, let's yeah. do it. It's an incredible view, but there's so many people up here and it's freezing. It's so windy on this side. <laughs> These your new best friends? You guys are hungry. Hard. You ready to head back down? I think I've taken in all the sights and I'm freezing. <laughs> nice. So, let's go. Well, the view was pretty amazing, but was it worth 32 bucks? I don't know. There was so many people up there. Definitely. And today it was really cold. On yeah. a warmer day, it'd probably be better, but it would also probably be even more crowded. Yeah. Yeah, I would just say, don't go in the winter time, maybe. <laughs> yeah, not a great idea. No. So since we're going to be in Europe for quite a while after our cruise, which is just a couple weeks away, we're trying to figure out how to handle our cell phones so that we have data over there when we're just wandering around. Uh, but it's tough because we're not going to be in any place for like 30 days. And if you buy just like a SIM card with data, I think you know you buy a couple gigabytes but it costs like 40 or 50 bucks and you can only use it in that country so what we're going to try to do is go to t-mobile i think they have like a 50 dollars a month international plan where you get like limited data in a handful of countries or something like that so fingers crossed that works out while you are overseas in 120 countries okay you will have a limited data a limited data with 2g speed well guys that was kind of a fail <laughs> yeah the guy said that basically the speeds are super slow and we can't we have to activate the service the day that we're in the store but we don't need the service until about a month from now on may 1st when we're actually in europe so and i don't think there are t-mobile stores in barcelona spain no. or at least i looked it up and i didn't see any so, so now we gotta add one more thing to the to-do list to figure out yeah Yay. so i guess we're gonna end up just getting sim cards in the different places but i'm sure that cost is gonna rack up pretty quickly yeah all right but right now we're gonna go we found a really cool place on yelp to eat we're gonna go check it out right now I think we made the right call with lunch. The place turned out to be pretty awesome. Yeah. Now we're gonna find a place to 
hunker down and get some laptop time in. We're at the Ace Hotel, which is one of our favorite places to work in the city, but it's so freaking crowded in here. We can't get a single spot. Look at this. This is insane, right? And the minute someone leaves, someone else just swoops in and takes it. It's free for all here. We ended up finding a spot and we're able to get a couple hours of work done, which was awesome. And Although, to get out of the cold for a second. Yeah, but now it is even colder out here. <laughs> so we're gonna head to a grocery store, grab something to eat, bring it over to, we're actually staying in Jersey City because it's a lot cheaper <laughs> yep. than Manhattan. There actually wasn't a single Airbnb in Manhattan that was within our price range. <laughs> no, not a single one. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna do that and then we're gonna hit the subway and head back. Kombucha! This girl we'll likes out. kombucha. It's my new favorite. We're addicted to it, man. You guys. It's good. It sounds horrible, and some of it really is, but some of it's really good. Yeah. <laughs> Tonight's definitely a pre made meal kind of night. I think I'm going for this. What did you pick? I'm I said, marsala. yeah. I said I was going to do a salad, but this looks too good. That looks good. I'd go for that. Yeah. Gosh dang it. I think these little microwave dinners are gonna be pretty good. Mm -hmm. I have a confession to make though. We went about five years without using a microwave when we lived in San Francisco. Just because they didn't have one. And then we were like, well, maybe we don't need one. Yeah. <laughs> but now we're using one. It kind of feels icky. Does it it's, feel wrong? It's like three minutes and you have a nice meal instead of an hour and a half of cooking. That and then you have a right. nice meal. <laughs> but we're gonna eat these. Maybe watch Little Walking Dead. I don't know. We haven't quite caught up on it. No, no spoilers. We, we tried last night. We got yeah. three episodes through. Dude, the second half of, of the latest season is blowing my mind. It's hardcore stuff, yeah. man. I couldn't even sleep last night. I shouldn't even do this to myself, but <laughs> it's too good. It's Gotta too watch good. it. Yeah. Good night, adventurers. We'll see you on the road.